Welcome back to AFL Insider. Well, two weeks ago, the Port Adelaide Football Club were fantastic in giving Fox Footy enormous access to the coach's box. Let's have a look at Ken Hinckley, how they made some key decisions regarding the substitute player and the full forward position. We want to tell our boys that we don't want to overuse the ball. It's slippery out there. We want Stuart on Watts. Blokes who move with some urgency get noticed. Blokes who don't, don't get the ball ever. We want to tackle, we want to tackle Josh. 23, 26 in games. So that means come hard at him. See Gus going around again? Tell him to stay. Get him to fall back. Tell Chad to keep running, not to come to the bench. Yes, we don't want to let this out. Get Amy shot, boys, get him off. at that half-time break, but a really important goal for us. What I'd love to see you now is grow on from that. Hey, Brody, tell Brody before he goes on. Grab Brody. Tell him to go on. We want to respect play football. We don't want to be showboaters. Marks the runner, puts it in front. All about the bounce again. It scoots on. Class got Tringo bearing down. Brilliant tackle. Ball spills. Tringo was over him. Oh, he's left. He's done. He's done. Right? Just keep in mind, if he goes, he's going to go smaller because it'll be... Um, it it'll be he's off to now, Richard. Yeah, cool. Is yeah. Billy's quick, Kim? Yeah, he's quite quick. Is he good? So Blues is going to come on, Mark. Yeah, so I'll shake, I'll, Jones can play smaller. I'll shake and play on a small, a medium. Well... We're going to be fine. We well, used talked about Chad, we talked about a couple others. Yeah. I'm thinking about a Ruckman, Rennie, I've got to be honest. Yeah. Oh, wait, the, the one for me is, who does Jacko go to? Because Camo shows Ben Seller. Yeah. So I believe that. Yes. Jonas, Jack Jack start had him. Jacko yeah. can play top small. Play just medium? No, 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 boys, you can't, mate. Mm. Not on Blues. Not Blues. No. So slide across to... Pedersen. 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 Oh, yeah, definitely. Yeah, but no. the, the other thing is if you... Come on, kids. Put it through. Ken, if you sell a rock from Jacko. So now that Clark's gone... Get in for it. You look at head. Now that Clark's gone... It'll be Jacko to take the second call. I can't do it for him on Salah. I want to leave those shame on Salah, so it'll be Jacko to go to Jacko. Really good. Really good. Nixie, Nixie, that might be our call. Cool. Jacko can play ruck. Hang on, Curry. Now let it go at the moment, but Jacko can go to the ruck. Yeah. All right? And then we can start a ruck. That's a really good call, Rennie. Well done. Wingard gets and kicks on the spin. Full forward, broadbent up. Dumps it through. Right, what can you do, mate? Yeah. Anything you suggest up to be set up in front of the ball? Or have we got a better match up out of the goal square? I know we're getting lots out of the play, but is Wingo got a chance to catch it one on one, too? This is where we're going to go, Shane. Whether you put the ruck there, I don't know, put a ruck there and let him just try and work it on his head. Yeah, yeah. In the back. We're just looking confident to move down for it. I think Lowe's has just been pushed forward, so. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Pressure's admirable, but we've got to make a score. What about Blond Fixie? Can we afford not to have him on the wing and get him to. He'll get off his man, he'll give us yeah, something yeah, to kick to. I reckon he gives you a bit of smarts down there. Are you looking for a lead up or just a Well, let's put the summary which you who can I reckon. make the most of an opportunity. I reckon. I just got to be chat. Chat on Monfish too. Monfish is the one I reckon. Get him red, get red and off. He looks cooked, get him off. Some Gus Ford. Over the top three. Oh, well done. Captain, yeah. Oh, you can sort of board him. That's what we're going to get him, He's almost let him out. He's going to come back and push forward. Centering kick. on freeze. Hard work pays off. Fantastic look into the inside of what goes on, the mechanics of the uh, coach's box, boys. I thought that was great vision, great audio, and we again thank the Port Adelaide Football Club for allowing us that insight. It's uh, a tremendous 
thing to see. Lynchy, something different, something for our viewers that we Absolutely. don't often see. That's fantastic. Well, I mean, you haven't been in the coach's box for a couple of years. What's yep. been the big change? I mean, obviously, it seems like there's more people in the box, but how did it operate? What impressed you most? Uh, just the, how calm it was. Yep. Uh, that was the thing that struck me straight away, just how calm it was, and everyone had their role, and that was all they focused on. And the collaborative decision-making process was terrific. Um, Surely calmness should be judged when they're 79 points down, not 79 yeah, points and, in front. And that was, look, that was disappointing. I was hoping mm. for a nail-biter, yeah. just to see the yeah, whole thing under yeah. stress. Um, you say that every week, Rocket. You're probably more familiar with that than any of us. But uh, yeah. does that does that ring true with what you're used to week to week? Uh, yeah, sometimes when you're when you're in front as well by that margin that some some players start to get comfortable and go outside yeah. your structures, and that and that sort of gets frustrating as well. So I think it's more about about the way you want your team to play and, and where blokes position themselves at certain times. Even if you're yep. down by four or five goals, that's working and you can test the balls okay. You, you know, you're reasonably happy and you know that there's an actual chance to turn it around. Right, Kingy, I want to take you back to Sunday afternoon at the MCG. Massive